want to do is actually make a fairy wheel out of chocolate, all edible, and then use it to display our afternoon tea cake pieces on. And here's a prototype we made, and obviously it's very small in comparison, but it moves. And it's all made of white chocolate, Belgian white chocolate, of course. So I've made some sheets of tempered Belgian dark chocolate, which I'm going to put on the machine and I have to line them up to be precise. This is the CAD design for the Ferris wheel that I'm cutting out now. The, the machine actually cuts with a very fine water jet and it gets a precision finish. So I'm just wiping any splashes of water that the machine has created and if you look you can see the amazing design for the ferris wheel. All the bits that are left we can use for decorations or additional pieces and these are the carriages and this is the side pieces of my ferris wheel. So to start constructing, to put the chocolate together, I'm just melting very gently the sides of the chocolate bases with a blow torch and it's quite cold in the room so the pieces stick together quite simply and then putting together the side panels onto the base plate uh, melting it again with a blow torch very very gently I might add and then that creates a very stable piece so now with our ferris wheel we have the really really difficult part of it which is putting the wheel on and making it spin so I've cast a large chocolate pipe and I'm threading this through the centre of the wheel and then this is the part that's going to make it spin. Okay, so the next stage then is to place the wheels at the right distance apart to be able to hang the carriages. So I have my, um, my, my I suppose you call them the dowels, the chocolate dowels that are going to hang the carriages and I've measured how far apart they are and now I'm going to actually use a little bit of chocolate to seal the main cog to the two outer ferris wheels so that they can spin in unison. About five minutes later and the chocolate is set because it's so cold in this room and it's great news because it spins. I've cast some chocolate dowels and these are going to allow me to put the carriages onto the ferris wheel. So the dowel goes through the outer wheel and then through the carriage and then into the inner wheel. But it's important that they're the right length. I'm using some chocolate in a piping bag just to seal up the dowels. Now for the best part, I'm going to use my fantastic Ferris wheel to display my wonderful afternoon tea. And here's a few pieces that we made earlier. Our first piece, which is perfect for summer, is a peach bellini, followed by a lovely strawberry entremont, which is layered strawberries and cream. And then I've got a baked cheesecake, which is topped with mixed berry and a honey cake. A pistachio and raspberry choux, and then an opera cake, which has been cut on the water cutter. Followed by a classic Victoria sponge and a passion fruit tart. And then lastly, we've got a coconut and lime dome, which makes a fantastic display for a summer afternoon tea. Our afternoon tea is available for delivery right across South Wales. So if you're having a tea party at home, check out our website, www.lacrempatisserie.co.uk. Some examples of the products that we make and the chocolate sculptures that we've delivered.